What is up you guys, Derby here back again for more crypto news. Today we have our first wallet to review. This wallet is called Tor Wallet and it's not only just a wallet itself, it's also a DEX. And one thing very cool is, wait till I show you the wallet, you'll be mind blown. This wallet is also cross-chain, which also swaps native assets from one chain to another. Not only that, but if you want to earn passive income as well, this wallet itself earns you this passive income. It's very interesting. Stay tuned till the end. Subscribe down below if you want more wallets reviews let's get right to it first things first this is the website of the wallet after i show you the wallet then i will show you the app but let's take a look at a few features of it yes this is the contract address for the governance token here it is it's tall wallet governance token tgt and currently now there's 2000 over holders so if you take a look at something interesting right here you can earn up to 18 over percent with just btc that's really crazy because btc is the king of all coins if holding btc is not safe for you i don't know what is and also this is how the app looks like. I have the test version of the app, but if you want to download the app, you can download it right here. It is currently now both on App Store and Google Play Store. This is how it looks like. So this is on Google Play Store and this is on App Store. And if you hold any TGT token or if you're watching this video right now and you go and buy some, make sure to stake it now because the staking is currently now live on the website itself. You can earn up to 12.62% APY by taking advantage of the premium features. Just click right here. You'll be led into this. You see all the staking pools. Connect to your web tree. Connect to your MetaMask. So obviously you need some TGT token in order to stake. You can see the pending rewards right here the stake the amount right here and your tier as well there's different kinds of tiers with different kinds of apys and these are the tiers right here you got the standard tier community tier and also community plus the difference between the tiers is the difference between the liquidity fee and the trading fee. For the standard one is 1% and for the community plus is 0%, nothing at all. So what do I consider them and what do they consider themselves? They consider themselves as the Robin Hood of DeFi. Robin Hood is obviously the biggest exchange for stocks, but on DeFi there's still a huge opportunity for someone to be the reigning king and Thor Wallet in my opinion can be the next Robin Hood of DeFi. Is this all in one app that no other platform has? You can swap, you can earn, and the earnings is not just on one chain itself, it's on multiple chains. Not only that, but if you're into NFTs and if you enjoy NFTs or collecting NFTs, trading NFTs, if you're even like a day trader for NFTs itself, they have their own NFT collection, it's for the Thor Wallet Army. The commander is obviously the rarest one and there's 20 collectibles. General is sold out and soldier is sold out. You can make an offer on OpenSea, just click here. This store wallet collection has basically 2,000 items and 1,800 holders. It's distributed very fairly. The volume trade is really good as well, 65 ETH and the floor price is 0.04. So if you want to be supportive of Thor Wallet and you really believe that they're going to be the next Robin Hood of DeFi, go purchase yourself one of these NFTs and make sure to follow them on Twitter and turn on the notification bell because they might have some upcoming news which you might be interested in. And obviously, if you want to join the community, join them on Discord itself because they have a huge community of 3,000 members. Now let's dive into the app. So this is how the app looks like. Take a look how clean the page is. This looks really nice and you can see on the side there, TGT, that's the ERC20, that's E the Synth. So these are the different chains that they are on. And this is the overview of the pools. There's the available pools, your pools. I do not have any pools as of now. And there's pending deposits, there is pending pools. And these pools are obviously on multiple chains. So this is how the pool looks like. Let's say I click on BUSD, which is 68% APR. It's a very high percent for stable coin and if you take a look right here you can add both BUSD and Rune to provide for the LP in order to get the APR or you can do single asset staking which is add only BUSD or only Rune and here's where you can alter the percentage as well you can either do 50-50 with BUSD and Rune or you can do 25% BUSD and 75% Rune so let's say I put $15 for BUSD. The estimated fee will be $56 if it's urgent. And then you can click add liquidity now. Just key in your password. And there you go. Just wait for a bit right here. All is done and you get the affiliate fee as well. And you can take a look at their mission right here. Start your first mission and earn TGT token. Upgrade your community plan to maximize rewards. Like I said earlier, if you take a look at the website, there is three different tiers, standard, community, and community plus. And there's also new missions right here, which you can do multiple swaps in order to earn USD. And there's a settings page right here which you can even have your biometrics on it And you can even erase your wallet if you do not want the wallet anymore One thing I really like as well, you can check your tokens and your NFTs as well on the wallet itself Your NFTs you can check in on wallet that makes it so easy You can purchase TGT on SushiSwap And now let me just demonstrate on how to swap cross-chain So just click the middle button right here at the bottom 
and click swap in the middle. Not enough room to swap LTC. In order to handle LTC, you need to pay gas fees. Okay, this is only for Litecoin. So if you're not gonna swap Litecoin, you do not have to worry about this. Continue anyway. So let's say the most common ones that I would want to swap is usually, usually BUSD on the Binance Smart Chain Network over to ERC20, maybe USDC. On the ERC20, you can see there, that's the ERC20. Wait, let me just show you again, USD. ERC20 and SYN, so click the ERC20 one. Sometimes you just need it in ERC20, so this is a great way to cross over. So let's say I want to swap like 1000 BUSD over to USDC on the ERC network. So just click preview swap, and there's a gas fee over there. The gas fee right now is $105, but this is just an estimate. And this is for urgent as well. You can see right down here, there's urgent, there's normal, there's fast. So make sure to click on urgent if you want it immediately. And if you want lower fees, obviously you can upgrade your community plan. And then after that, just click swap now. It's that simple. But right now I don't have any funds in it. So obviously I can't demonstrate a swap. Just now what I showed you, the gas fee was really high. It's because it's a cross chain. Cross chains generally tend to be high because you're moving one chain to another, especially when it's to ERC20. ERC20 is one of the most expensive chains out there. So let's say you want to do BUSD to BTC. You can see right here the estimated fee. And if you click on normal, not urgent, it's only 67 cents. If you click urgent, it's only $1. So if you continue right here, just put in your password and then you can follow your transaction after you click continue. And there you go. It's that simple. But if you have questions and you want them to be answered, there's an FAQ right here. Anyway, let's just go back and let me show you more of their features. Here you have received. So if you want to receive any coin on Tor Wallet, let's say you want to do USDT on ERC network, you can just click here and this is a QR code, just scan it with your other wallet or you can just copy the address right here. So this is for receive if you want to send the same thing as well. If you have any assets to send, they'll show you right here. Just copy your other wallet's address and paste it here and just send it. So that's all for the wallet. It's really straightforward, really simple. Any new beginner can use this wallet. To sum it all up, Thor Wallet Dex is basically a one-stop shop app for the masses to take part in the decentralized finance. This is a revolution, guys. It is a non-custodial wallet that gives you full control over the keys with an integrated cross-chain DEX that allows users to swap their native L1 tokens across different blockchains without any intermediary. You can see right here that their fiat on off RAM with no KYC is coming soon, plus the credit card offering linked to your non-custodial wallet. It's expected to be on Q1 or Q2 of 2023, and it's going to be available in 171 different countries. And Thor Wallet DEX actually participated and won the Startup World Cup competition in Dubai. Take a look at this. The judges got convinced that this is the strongest and the best product on the market right now and they're currently discussing with different various VCs in order for more expansion and growth and if you take a look right here they're currently starting up and they're working on the web-based exchange they're gonna work on the best UI UX and allow you to have amazing user experience also right here you can earn up to $150 in TGT as long as you download this and complete the mission within the given time frame. So do those missions right now. Now the crazy thing is they're going to have their pooling promotions for their TGT pool because it's now live. What they're going to do is they're going to offer you up to 80% APR, not APY, APR by providing liquidity for the TGT pool. This promotion only lasts three weeks so right now it's almost the end of it. But they might have more in the future so be up to date by following them and turning on the notification bell on their Twitter page. So it's very simple, Thor Wallet Dex just wants to fast track Tor Chain into becoming the leading DeFi infrastructure, making DeFi accessible for anyone, even the normies, even the average people, to be adopted and accustomed to using it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my wallet review. This is the first ever wallet review I've done. If you do have any questions, subscribe down below, turn on the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.